I definitely have a new respect for water and how important it is to us. I also have this kind of new understanding of where I'm wasting water the most. I've, I've kind of have a new respect and a value for water. With the water scarcity announcement, it was just a reality check on what am I doing, what can I do to save more and just to, to think more before opening the tap or even just emptying out used water. Our last year's scarcity really changed my view of water because it was just basically a reminder on how important um, water is and uh, it changed my view in that uh, out of everything that I was already doing in terms of trying to save water, I just basically had to up my game. Yeah, I just prep all my jelly dishes and put them in the fridge and then once I've got enough load basically, I wash them. I actually still do that. I still use grey water to flush my toilet because it's actually saving me money. And also with regards to meals, as a mom having to cook for a family of five, I had to come up and be creative with my cooking. If I did make pasta, I would reduce the pasta cooking time. We forget that pasta works with tomato sauce most times, and that liquid can cook the pasta further. So with regard to showering, it was a big uh, adjust, adjustment because we had to reduce our showers to about two minutes at one point, and that was quite hard for me. If it's yellow, let it mellow. If it's brown, flush it down. So that's how I live as well. Water is life. Without water, you wouldn't really have anything. We are very ignorant as to how much water we have. We have to give thought to every action we take. Water is life. We need water and water doesn't need us. Water is very important, not just for human beings, but um, for every living or living thing on Earth. Nature can live on its own, but we need nature more than anything. And water is part of nature. We have to and respect water and start to, to appreciate water. You can survive without food, but you cannot survive without water.